today I was really in the mood to shoot this video. I actually am shooting this intro separate, so um, I wanted to do a spring cleaning, going through all of my makeup, doing a declutter video, and I hope you guys will enjoy this. Um, I'm going to make this really short because I don't want to be too long. So basically, I'm going to take you on a journey through my makeup. I'm going to get rid of stuff that is old, outdated, some things I just don't use that I'm going to give away to family and friends. I hope this inspires you guys to do some spring cleaning and to clean out your makeup collection and get rid of those old mascaras and products that are outdated because you don't want to put mildew infested bacteria old makeup on your face because that's just not pretty so i hope you guys enjoyed this video don't forget to thumbs up and subscribe and i will see you guys in my next video and if i'm looking the same way it's probably because i'm going to film a few videos today and thanks so much for watching enjoy bye hey guys so i'm doing a declutter video today i thought it'd be a lot of fun summer's coming up and if you're wondering this is um my apartment this is like a half bath and this is where I store all my makeup um, just to give you an overview of the room I have a ton of stuff under here that I'm trying to go through and decide what I want to keep what I want to give away my empties bag is already full that I do my empties uh, video in and that is already full so I'll definitely be doing a video on that really soon coming up and by the way if you hear water running it's my neighbors they I don't know what is with them. They keep doing stuff. So, so in this drawer, I have just oh boy, this is a total, total mess, and it's a mess up here too. I'm trying to figure out if I want to throw away these boxes, um, some empty elf containers, uh, plumpy mascara. <laughs> this is uh, eyeshadows from the elf. Um, beauty books that I depotted and I had nowhere to put them. Um, I really need to get like a Z palette or uh, something like that. But I just put them in this CD case. I know it's kind of odd. But they're just sitting in there. This stuff over here I'm not that crazy about. I don't even use these. They're the e.l.f. duos and the eyeshadow sticks. I just don't really like these. I don't know if I'm going to keep those or not because they're just sitting here wasting away and maybe I could give them to somebody who does like them. I just, they creased on me so bad and they kind of stink. Alright, now here's a drawer that I've been wanting to go through for a long time. I have a lot of uh, pellets and drugstore stuff that I really do need to go through. I really do like these single eyeshadows from L'Oreal. Um, this Victoria's Secret palette, I just, I don't know. I mean, I like it, but the colors don't show up that much. Like, I had a, they're really difficult to blend. I don't know if it's just this one palette. This is called Ravishing. I've had these for years, probably since I was a young teenager. I got these from Hot Topic. See, Hot Topic. Um, they kind of irritated my eyes. The colors are really pretty. You got like a hot pink and a bright, like, neon green here. It's really pretty and they are really pigmented, but it's very old. I'd say probably more than four years old. Got some, this old, old, old Rimmel London palette. This is like old school. <laughs> I've had this for so long. Love this palette. This is like the one I used every single day before I started like collecting makeup and everything. This is called the Special Eyes Trio Eyeshadow in Lavender Mist. Very sorry about some of these palettes, by the way, that are really dirty. They're really old. Um, this one I actually have hit pan on. I must have enjoyed this. I'll have to get this back out again. I'm not sure if it's... Uh, this is called... What is this one called? It's the Eye Enhancers. Those are the shades Double Espresso, Mocha Latte, and Sugar Rush. These two here, I don't use these. I haven't picked these up. I probably haven't grabbed these or gotten these out in probably over a year. Crystal Waters. So that's what this one is called. Crystal Waters. I'm just not that crazy about CoverGirl products in general or their eyeshadows. Sorry guys. <laughs> I'm just not. So I think I'm going to get rid of that. I've been holding onto that for a really, really long time. And this one as well. I hardly use this one. And this one is called Blossoms. 
This L'Oreal one is really old. I wonder if I should part ways with this. This is called Blackened Smokes. Oh yeah. I've had this one for a long time. I put a really good dent. Oh, and it's broke. Like this. Oh. <laughs> like I said, it's broke. These little iPods. 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 From e.l.f. Um, I do like these, but I don't ever use them. So, I'm going to set those out. Because I don't know. I don't know if I'll keep those or not. It came in a set. Um, what's right here? Hard candy. I was so excited to get one of these. Um, it's the, what is this called? Ooh, Top 10 Eyeshadow Collection in Feeling Blue. And if you all know me, you know I love the color blue. And I was, ah, oh, so thrilled to get this. And it has a little mirror too. Hi. But if you look up closely, see how kind of rough they look? They are so crumbly and powdery and chalky. I was just really, really disappointed. Um, there's a couple in here that are okay, but um, yeah, I think I might be letting this go. So here is one of my uh, makeup drawers here at the top. I've been wanting to go through this for a very long time. I've been putting it off and putting it off, but I think today is the day. So this is pretty much all lipsticks that I just don't have sitting out for display. So I have here like some random CoverGirl ones. Um, this one I'm definitely going to get rid of, so I'm going to pull that one out. These are a whole bunch of NYC lipsticks, and you know what? I'm ready, so ready to get rid of these. They sit in here. I don't use them very often. Well, let's see. The one that I use the most, I'd say, is this one, and it's called uh, Moose. But these two, I'm definitely getting rid of. Here's the numbers if you're wondering, 545A, 502A, give it to a family member who can use them and enjoy them. Alright, so moving to the back row here, I've been holding on to these for so long. These, these are the old Revlon Color Renewist lipsticks and these are just in a really cool clear packaging with the Revlon and it's like rubber right here. I'll show you what they look like. Um, and they twist up and they have like a middle part, I don't know if you can see it there, where like that's like the moisture or something. I really did like these. I got these at Big Lots probably three years ago, I'd say now. These are the old Neutrogena lipsticks. They do not make these anymore, as far as I know. And again, I really did like these. I did use up... This one I use quite a bit. This one is called Think Pink. I really just need to let, let them go, you know? They're sitting around. I have quite a few. All right, so moving on. I've really been wanting to go through this drawer as well. It's just full of, oh my goodness, it's just, it's just crazy mayhem in here. Maybe I can try to make use for it, but it's in the wrong shade. It's the L'Oreal True Match Stick. And I got it in the warm 1, 2, 3. And I think I should have got the warm 1, 2. Because the foundation that I have um, is W1, 2. So I guess I got the wrong. <laughs> but yeah, I'm going to put that out because I'm not sure about that. Um, the next green HD concealer. I did like this and it is a really good concealer but it broke me out so so bad. Um, I guess you could use, I could try using it under my eyes maybe, I don't know. Alright so I've got more things I want to look through. This I'm definitely ready to get rid of. This is the Revlon Lip Butter in Tutti Fruity. I mean it's a pretty color but it does not look pretty on me so maybe I can give that to someone. Um, and also the Revlon Just Kissable Lip Stain. I don't know what it was about these, but I just did not like them. This one's in Honey. It's brand new. I barely used it. Didn't like it, so I can definitely get rid of that. Um, this needs to go. This is a really old Maybelline Shine Sensational. This is from, like, a holiday collection I had a long time ago. Like, I don't know, they had some kind of holiday, like, special thing. 
Uh, this is Cranberry Crave. It smells really good, but I mean, look, I barely used it. So this, this I can get rid of. This is the e.l.f. Um, lip stain, and this was not that great. I wasn't too impressed with it. It's already dried out, so maybe I'll just put that in my empties video. Oh, I have been holding on to this for a long time, and I'm going to keep it because it's just one of those things that, oh, I don't want to get rid of. This is one of the e.l.f. minty lip glosses, and if you're not fami familiar with uh, some of the earlier things from e.l.f., they discontinued these, and I was so disappointed. This one is in Nashville. Oh, please, Elf, bring these back because they were my favorite. That's it. Here's a Wet n Wild thing that I do not use. Um, it's a Perfect Pair wand, lip wand. I know that everyone raves about these on YouTube, but uh, I don't know. I just, you know, I don't buy them anymore. You know, because it's a Maybelline new test. This is like brand new. Um, this, it's a pretty color, it smells like fruit punch, it smells delicious, and I really do like it, but I am so pale that this looks ridiculously pink on me, like, oh, I just, <laughs> I don't know, something about the color just doesn't look good on me, so I think I'm going to maybe see if my niece wants this. Oh, good lord. Um, I don't know where to start. Liners. These, I think, are still good. I don't know, I'll have to pull these out and check them. I've had those for quite a while. This is a hard candy eyeliner. Glitter liner. Walk the line liquid eyeliner. I've had this for a long time. Look at the packaging. Isn't that gorgeous? Oh, what is this? Oh, CoverGirl. Oh my god. These are so old, you guys. I've had these probably since I was a teenager. These are like the CoverGirl brow and eye maker in black. These are so old. I think it's time to get rid of these. So here's some lipsticks. I think I want to get rid of this L'Oreal one. I don't ever use it in Rose Taffeta. I really just wanted to pull this out. The um, Hard Candy A Thousand Lashes. This is the pink one. Hard Throb Pink. I really need to throw this away. It's really, really old. Like over a year. Just remember, girls, don't put this on your eyes. If it's over a year old, you need to really just pitch it. I really don't have that many eye pencils, and I would really like to uh, just buy all new, you know what I mean? Um, so I'm going to pull out some of these really old ones that I don't even use anymore, like these Wet n Wild ones, um, NYC ones that I just really don't use. Here's a blue one. Oh, I might keep that one. I'm just going to dig them all out. I must have really liked that purple one. Look how long those are when you first buy them. This will, like, last you your entire life. That's how crazy. <laughs> That's how crazy long those are. Alright, guys. So, this is all the stuff that I decided I need to just get rid of. And over here are the things out of that pile that I'm going to keep. Sorry that the counter is messy, it's just a mess because I've had everything out on here. Um, so I went through and swatched all the pencils. You can see here on the back of my hand and you know what? They all look really good. They all perform really well. So the L'Oreal one I definitely will keep and these paint pots from e.l.f. Brightening Eye Pots. Um, these are fantastic. I love those. They're great. I'm going to start using those more often. And this, I think I might get rid of. I'm, I'm still not sure which pile I want to put it in. I'm going to give it one more try. Um, I am keeping one of my uh, Milani. That They don't make these anymore, which is kind of sad. I really like these. Are they pretty? Pretty lipstick. This one is in Rose Taffeta. Rose Taffeta. Oh, Rose Fetish. Sorry. <laughs> Rose Fetish. And, uh... Not sure about the NYX concealer. I'm going to give it one more shot. Um, everything else here is good. This is what I'm getting rid of. I've got the Victoria's Secret palette, the Burma London one. Actually, I might need to throw this one away. Um, and then this stuff here I will be throwing away because it's very, very old. This is the other Milani one that I'm getting rid of. Um, creamy Cocoa. I tried it on and I was like, oh my god, what was I thinking when I bought this? It looks 
ridiculous on me. I mean, it's just so, like, it's pure gold. It's like a brown and gold mixed together. It's beautiful to look at, but, uh, I just can't, you know? So, I hope you guys enjoyed this declutter, I guess you could call it a vlog. I don't know. Maybe I will call it a vlog. If you're new to my channel, please subscribe so you don't miss out on new videos. And I will see you guys next time. If you have any questions or comments, just leave them down below. And remember guys, smarter beauty is better beauty. See you next time.